This video is brought to you by Zarkin Productions, an umbrella group composed of over 10 YouTube shows, an archive of over 4,000 videos covering a wide variety of topics, and businesses both inside and outside of Second Life. Please go to Zarkin.com for a complete listing of media links, follow us on Facebook and Twitter for our activity feed, subscribe to us on YouTube for future updates and please support us on Patreon. Thank you for your time, and may I present another, Zarakan production. Hello everyone, welcome to ZOC, I'm your host Andrew Carvin, and today I'd like to talk to you about the Orion Legacy AR504LR-BK 2.1 speaker system with subwoofer and remote for MP3 PC game console and HDTV black, 70 watts of pumping power to excite your ears with entertainment. Uh, I got the large. Uh, they do have other sizes. Here's the medium. Here's the extra large. And here's the large. I mainly got the large because I need something with a remote. Because this is not going to be connected to a computer, but is actually going to be connected to a HDTV in my bedroom. And uh, I don't sleep right next to the TV, so naturally I need a remote. Large number of dedicated acoustic drivers deliver a great sound stage. Two tweeters, four woofers, and one subwoofers. All wood subwoofer and satellite cabinets. Convenient wireless remote and industry standard RCA slash 3.5 millimeter audio connection. Subwoofer mounted LCD display and audio controls. And I like that just because it looks cool. Designed for large home offices, desktop PC, laptop, tablets, and smartphones. Package includes two satellites, one subwoofer, remote control, user manual, 3.5 mm to RCA audio cable, one year limited warranty. Specifications, total peak power 70 watts, total RMS power 35 watts, satellite RMS power 10 watts times 2, Subwoofer RMS power 15 watts times 1. Satellite drivers, dual 3 inch woofers, and one 1 inch tweeter. Subwoofer drivers, one 5 inch subwoofers, satellite dimensions, blah blah blah. Subwoofer dimensions, blah blah blah. Uh, all that might mean something to somebody, but not me. I just like it because it looks really nice. And at 70 watts, and after comparing it to the kind of sound that my PC speakers can deliver, this will be more than enough to have great sound in my bedroom. Here we have some more details. Ryan Legacy. The Ryan Legacy was established to capture the language that connects us all. Sound. Powered by the vision to change the way we all see, hear, and experience music. The incorporation of modern aesthetics acoustic precision and practical functionality makes Orion Legacy the audio solution of choice for all your everyday home audio needs. AR504 Home Audio 2.1 Speaker System Affordable Quality Home Audio Speaker System You'll be hard pressed to find another 2.1 speaker system that provides full spectrum range and 75 watts of power the AR504 boasts seven active acoustic drivers, each tuned to reproduce sound that is accurate, loud, and detailed. The precisely placed bass reflex port enhances the lower frequency response so your bass hits harder and cleaner. Stiff comb materials withstand rapid vibrations so the high sound clear and crisp, and the heavy duty coils ensure the speakers last for a very long time. Power transformers feature pure copper wires for improved energy performance and uniform current distribution, providing you with consistent, powerful sound. Total peak power 70 watts, total RMS power 35 watts. 
Satellite armor's power, 10 watts times 2. Subwoofer for armor's power, 15 watts times 1. I have no idea what RMS power is, but post in the comments below if you know. Satellite drivers, dual 3-inch woofers and 1-inch one, one tweeter and wooden cabinet. Subwoofer drivers, 5-inch subwoofers and wooden cabinet. Uh, dimensions. I don't really think that you'll have much trouble fitting this thing in because they're not really that big. I have the box next to me. And uh, it's not very big. Wide spectrum audio, the AR 504 has a frequency response of 20 hertz to two, 20 hertz to 20 kilohertz, which means it's capable of reproducing most of the audio frequencies we're capable of hearing, without needing any additional equipment. What does this mean for you? Well, it means you experience all the details, instruments, and sounds in your music that you may not have heard before. Loud room filling sound. This system has 70 watts peak watts, which means brief sessions of high volume will deliver loud room filling projection that can be heard hallways down. Even at high volume, the AR504 will still retain the sound quality and have virtually no distortion. 35 watts RMS allows you to play music at pretty high levels consistently over a long period of time without incurring damage. To the, the speaker system. <laughs> you may not, may not want to blow out your own eardrums. Uh, again, I'll be using this in my bedroom, which isn't uh, very big, so I'll probably never use a full 70 watts, but it's good to know the power is there, and if I need it. Wireless remote, definitely a necessary thing. Cannot, cannot be without this. Uh, take control of your audio experience with a provided remote control. Easily customize your audio with adjustable treble, bass, and master volume. Relax, sit back, and control your music from anywhere in the room. Like, from the bed. All wooden enclosures. Wooden enclosures help make the sound more cleaner, higher, tighter, more accurate, faster, stronger, work it, and more accurate as opposed to plastic enclosures that make the sound quality low and muddy. What can you connect to the AR504? Well, let me tell you. PC laptop. Easily connects to any PC laptop using the included 3.5 millimeter audio plug. PlayStation. Xbox. Maybe even your Wii. The AR504 connects to your game consoles to help you create a better gaming experience. Xbox users will need a separate audio adapter. Uh, smartphones and tablets. Uh, play music from any smartphone or tablet instantly with the included 3.5 millimeter audio plug. TV, of course. Need an affordable quality home theater speaker system? The AR504 can do that for you too. And uh, here's some of the other ones they offer. So the AR504 is like mid-range, but it has the most important feature, the wireless remote. Apparently the AR506 and AR508 also have wireless remotes. Well, the AR508 has a wireless remote. This one has a wired control pod, which doesn't really work from across the room, so definitely a good buy. And like I said, I really like the way it looks, too. You know, I don't really need a full console system right on the subwoofer. I'm mostly going to be using it from across the room. But enough about the Amazon posting. Uh, let's go take it out of the box. Uh, find out how my TV sounds now. And then install these speakers. And then find out how it sounds afterwards. So here's the box it comes in. Just a plain old box. AR504 2.1 speaker system with subwoofer and remote control. So let's get this thing open. And we have another box inside the box.
Okay. This one looks a little bit better. Alright, so again. The AR 504 2.1 subwoofer speaker system. Top, we have your cables and the remote, so that's where that is. And here's the subwoofer and the two speakers off to the side. Just connection to it. the other one. Okay. Get plastic off of these things. The plug on the back. So you have your audio outputs, inputs, CD off on switch, and of course the power plug itself. The speakers are color coordinated, so it makes it really easy to figure out where you're going to put them. This one goes in the right, and that one goes in the left. So pretty simple to set up. There you have it. Pretty cool, huh? Alright, so let's see what we're working with. So this is the TV it's going to be connected to. A Insignia HDTV uh, 720. This is the first HDTV we ever got. We moved it in here after we got the 55-inch uh, 1080p HDTV we have in our living room. So we're going to have a speaker over here on the left side, we're going to have a speaker over here on the right side, and the subwoofer is going to go down there, where the TV usually goes on an entertainment system, uh, to, so we can get some subwoofer power. But before we do that, let's see what the TV sounds like right now. Okay, for demonstration purposes, we're going to use a video I did for YouTube called Donald Trump Dances for Corporate Pigs. I have the TV set at 25 for volume. And that's really as far as you want to take up the TV before you start doing something to the speakers. So, let's give this a go. This is just with the TV speakers. is brought to you by Zarkin Productions, an umbrella group composed of over 10 YouTube shows, an archive of over 4,000 videos covering a wide variety of topics, and businesses both inside and outside of Second Life. Please go to Zarkin.com for a complete listing of media links, follow us on Facebook and Twitter for our activity feed, subscribe to us on YouTube for future updates, and please support us on Patreon. Thank you for your time, and may I present another Zarafin production.
Okay, so obviously if this kind of audio is all you have, then it's better than nothing. But it's very tinny, there's no bass to it. It sounds like crap compared to anything that has a, a sound system, a good sound system. So what we're going to do now is I'm going to set up the speaker system and then we're going to see what it sounds like with that running. Okay, this time we're playing the video with the speaker system. So there's one speaker, one speaker. Down there is the subwoofer. Now it should be noted that the uh, wires on this system are not very long, so you're not going to be putting these speakers and the subwoofer uh, very far away from the TV or very far away from each other for that matter. But it does, it's not a big deal, at least not for my setup, so here we go. Of over 10 YouTube shows, an archive of over 4,000 videos covering a wide variety of topics and businesses both inside and outside of Second Life. Please go to zarkin.com for a complete listing of media links. Follow us on Facebook and Twitter for our activity feed. Subscribe to us on YouTube for future updates, and please support us on Patreon. Thank you for your time, and may I present another Zarafin production. So obviously a huge improvement. Uh, let me stop this before it plays the next one. Obviously a huge improvement in the sound quality. Uh, very happy with this system and what it's and the difference it's making uh, for this entertainment system in my bedroom. Um, so it's going to make hearing things a whole lot easier, and it's going to make what I hear a whole lot more pleasurable because there's a lot more. There's a lot more frequency, there's a lot more bass. Well, there is bass, whereas there wasn't before. Um, I've already tested my the remote. Here's the remote. And the remote is easily operated from all the way back from the back of the bed. So there's not going to be any issue of 
adjusting the volume even with the base unit down there which of course is the thing that received the signal and another cool thing that I forgot to mention is the base unit doesn't have an AC adapter it's just a regular plug so however you have your plug set up it will make it that much easier to put it in so again this is an excellent system I totally recommend it excellent buy very happy with it and uh, I'm definitely going to enjoy it so get one today it's a great system to have